ever feel like you're gonna forget to breathe? Yeah. Like seriously, yeah. completely forget. Like you just stop. Yeah. yeah. Like that time I was trying to parallel park, you know, mm -hmm. and someone's like right on my bumper honking. Oh yeah. I know that feeling. I think I actually held my breath that whole time. It's like fight or flight takes over, it's right? It's like everything else just shuts down. Yeah, your body's just like, nope, we're out of here. Exactly. <gasps> but what if I told you our breath, secret weapon. Oh, tell me more. I could use some secret weapons. From handling all that stress. Well, we're diving into that today. I'm intrigued because, yes, yeah, stress is kind of a given these days. Isn't it? So we're going deep on how just breathing, plain and simple, okay. can bring us back from the brink. I like it. Yeah. Simple. What's the source material we're looking at? So we've got some cutting edge research lined up. Even this really inspiring story about a woman named Mia. I love a good story. Lay it on me. What's the connection? How does breathing like de-stress us? Well, it's all about your nervous system, right? Okay, yeah, I'm with you. So, you know that whole fight or flight thing? It doesn't, yeah. like a reflex, right? Right. But deep breathing. It's yeah. like hitting the brakes on that runaway train. So, less adrenaline spike, more chill. Exactly. It's about shifting from that fight or flight yeah. into rest and digest. Ooh, I like where this is going. Rest and digest. Yes. Much better than fight or flight. Right. And it's all thanks to this thing called the parasympathetic nervous system. Big words, breaking it down for us. It's basically the system that chills everything out. Okay, got it. Heart rate slows, you actually feel calmer. Yeah. It's wild. It is pretty wild how our body just knows how to do that. We just have to, you know, actually breathe. Totally. And that brings us to Mia's story. This woman, public speaking, was like her nemesis. The absolute worst, right? Yeah. I get it. Yeah, I still get the presentation jitters just thinking about it sure, sure but anyway she starts using focus breathing and here's the thing okay hit me with it not just during the speech she starts doing it beforehand like as prep interesting get ahead in the stress i like it right instead of trying to mask the fear she's changing her baseline smart so what happened did it work oh it totally worked tell me she crushed that speech more than crushed it before she'd freeze up you know yep voice gets shaky the whole nine yards yeah but this time She's calm, she's clear, even cracked a couple of jokes. No way, the power of breath, right. Right, her calmness actually drew the audience in. They were totally engaged. See, this is what I'm talking about. This is why we need these deep dives. So enough talk, how do we do it? Let's do it. You ready for a mini breathing exercise? Let's go, I'm feeling stressed just thinking about all the things I have to do later. Okay, so first things first, let's get comfy. Okay, I got it, getting comfy. And if you're into it, Close your eyes. Eyes closed. All right, here we go. Nice and slow. Inhale through your nose. Count of four. Inhale. Two, three, four. Hold it gently. Just two counts. Holding. And exhale slowly through your mouth. Another four counts. And exhale. Two, three, four. Wow. <laughs> See? Already feeling a difference. <laughs> right. Just one breath. But, you know, there are variations on this, too. Oh, really? Tell me more. Because I'm all about options. I read that visualizing like a calming image can be really helpful for some people. Oh yeah, I love that. Like imagining you're on a beach somewhere. Exactly. Or some people focus on the physical sensations, like their chest rising and falling. Interesting. I guess it's about finding what works for you. That's the thing I love about this. It's not just for like panic attacks or presentations. Right, it's for everyday life. We can use this anytime, anywhere, right? Right. Like imagine that tough conversation you've been putting off. Ugh, don't even remind me. Those are the worst. But instead of stressing, a few deep breaths changes the whole game. Oh, I can see that. Or even if you're just stuck on a work problem, you know? Deep breaths, focus sharpens, stress melts away. You know, I actually started doing this before important meetings. How's it going? It's a game changer. I walk in feeling so much calmer, more on point, like a superpower. It kind of is, right? Our own built-in superpower, always there when you need it. I know some people even use it to sleep better. Oh yeah, for sure. A little deep breathing before bed works wonders. So as we wrap up this deep dive, here's a little challenge for everyone listening. I like challenges laid on me. Try to work in some mindful breathing into your day. Okay. Even if it's just for a minute, set a reminder, make it a ritual. You might be surprised what a difference it makes. Love it. I'm all about making those little changes that have a big impact. Me too. All right. That's it for today's deep dive, everyone. Until next time. Bye, everyone.